Now God is making room for himself. He's in the body of a woman, praise our God, maturing just like a child. Imagine God, praise our God, maturing as a child. And when the fullness of time came, she brought forth her firstborn son, wrapped him in swaddling clothes and laid him in a manger. And the angels came down from heaven and hung a choir off in space and sang, Glory, 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 glory to God in the highest. Peace on earth, good will to all men. I bring you tidings, for there is born in the city of David this day a Savior, which is Christ the Lord. Hallelujah. God is in time. That news went across the universe. God is in time. 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 Satan say, what? God is in time? How did he get here? Praise the name of How did God get here? Somebody said he was born in Bethlehem of Judea. Praise the name of our God. Hallelujah. And the devil got in here and say, Praise God, you better send to Bethlehem and try to find him before he grow up. You know he's a terror when he grow up. You better kill him while he's a child. Satan got busy, ran to Bethlehem, Judea, checked on Jesus through the wise men, and the wise men say, yeah, he's there, all right. We saw him, we worshiped him. Praise the Lord. And then the devil says, all right, I'll tell you what you do. Say, go kill every male child, two years old and under, put them to death. I'm going to get rid of Jesus now before he gets too big for me to have. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. That's why you have it hard, young folks. Praise the Lord, because when you're young, the devil tries to kill you. Praise the Lord. Before you know too much about God, he tries to kill you. Before you know anything but the Holy Ghost speaking in tongues. Praise the name of God. He's trying to kill you. Before you know God is a way maker, God is a burden bearer, God is a heart regulator. He'll try to kill you before you get rooted and grounded in the Lord Jesus Christ. He tried to kill you before you get a hope for God. He'll try to kill you before you hang your hat on the everlasting promises of God. He'll try to kill you. But we are like the Lord. We live. <laughs> we live. Praise his dear name forever. And so, old Lucifer, praise our God, killed all these children and wrote God's obituary and praise the Lord and say, God is dead. God is dead. Praise our God. God told, the angel told uh, Mary and Joseph, said, run down to Egypt and stay down there for a little while because uh, I want to go down to Ham's country for a ride. I want to take a vacation. Praise the name of God. They put God on the back of a donkey, rolled on down to Egypt. Praise the Lord. God took a vacation down in Egypt. Praise the Lord and enjoyed himself. And while the devil was back in Jerusalem rejoicing, saying, God is dead. And then God came on back to Nazareth. Praise the Lord. Disguised himself as, as a regular student in the classroom. And the devil didn't know that God was still in time. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He's here right now. You might not know it, but he's here. Praise the name of our God. Hallelujah. You might say, I don't feel nothing. I believe you. I believe exactly what you say. But that don't mean I don't feel nothing. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. God is here, honey. I say he's here. He's here. He's walking right now from person to person and from heart to heart and from breast to breast. Now some of you, the Lord has to step over you because you are not ready to say he's here yet. Praise the name of God. <laughs> Woo, hallelujah. But if he isn't going to step over me, he's going to have to do something for me. Before he can get to you, he's going to have to stop in my heart and touch me and touch me and touch me. Praise the name of our God until I can feel what I want to feel. All right. Praise the name of God is in town now. Praise our God, Mary, taking God on his vacation down in Egypt and come back to Nazareth. Praise the Lord. And God went to school just like everybody else. And his uh, uh, father, supposedly Joseph, taught him how to do carpentry work. Praise the Lord. God had a hammer and a saw. Just sawing and nailing. Praise our God. This was a disguise. Because God doesn't need a hammer. 
God doesn't need a saw. God doesn't need a square. Because when you look up at the firmament, you can see God don't use hammers and squares and saws and what have you. Praise God. Look at the firmament. The Bible says he needed out the heaven with a span, comprehended the dust of the earth in a measure. God, without a hammer, without a saw, without a piece of wood, without a piece of steel, without any mortar, without any bricks, without any stone, flew in the firmament, a great big piece of the universe, and told it to hang there until I give you word to move. Praise the name of God. Made an earth for her footstool. Hallelujah. My God, her footstool. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Made an earth and say, that's my footstool. That's for me to put my foot on. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. The heaven is my floor and the earth is my footstool. I tell you, he's something else, isn't it? Praise the name of God to have a footstool like this. Hallelujah. To have a footstool like this. Praise God. The, 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 the engineer is messing with my, uh, my speaker. Praise the name of our God. Have a footstool like the earth. Praise the name of God. A footstool like the earth. To put your foot on. Heaven is your throne. Praise God from on high. Hallelujah. And here is God now down here on his footstool. Walking up and down on his footstool. Praise the name of God. And the devil doesn't know he's alive. Praise the Lord. And then King John the Baptist, preaching in the wilderness of Judea, saying, God is here. God is here. God is here. The devil told him, so go check that preach out. Praise the Lord, because he's talking about God is here. Went to check the preacher out. Say, are you, are you the Christ? John said, no, I'm not no Christ. I'm not God. Then who are you? John said, I'm a voice. Praise the crying in the wilderness. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. What kind of voice are you? I'm a voice to tell you to. He said, that's what you say. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. I'm here to tell you, behold the Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the earth. Praise the name of God. I'm here to tell you that God is alive. You can't prove it. You can't prove it. Oh, yes, I can. Praise the name of God. You just keep on following me down to the Jordan River. He's going to show up one day that all of a sudden, here comes God. Walking down to the Jordan River, John the Baptist saw him coming, and the Holy Ghost said, That's him, John. John said, The Holy Lamb of God takes away the sins of the world. And when they looked and saw Jesus, they laughed. Praise the Lord. Who that guy? That's, that's not God. That's Mary's baby. That, that bastard boy. Praise the boy out of wedlock. Praise the Lord. The demon reported back to Satan and said, oh, said they're all mixed up. They're all screwed up. Got a bastard talking about God. is in time. But oh, when Jesus started working, my God, hallelujah, when he started talking and walking and healing and delivering, praise the Lord. Satan said, I better take a second look at this fella. Because he's doing things that an ordinary prophet can't do. Satan checked him out, going and coming. Praise the name of our God. And some of the demons that was doing the checking, praise the Lord, discovered that they didn't have no power against him. Praise the Lord, they came against him, and Jesus Christ rebuked him and said, Come out of thy man. Praise the Lord. The demons came out and went back and told the devil, So you better go check him out yourself. Because he told us to come out, and we rebelled, and he made us come out. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. Oh, glory be to God. He's setting folks free everywhere. He's taking the blind, giving them their sight, taking the deaf, giving them their hearing. He's raising the dead, unstopping the deaf ears. This man must be something. You better go and check him out. Praise the name of God. Say this, I tell you what. Praise the Lord. Say, you're all, all excited about nothing. This guy is an imposter. You all know he's a bastard. Praise our God. Born out of wedlock and you're calling him Christ. Praise God. So next time he get in that boat and go out there with all those disciples, 
Say, you get up in the winds and get in the waves and rock that boat and blow that wind and rock that boat and blow that wind and we'll sink them. Praise the Lord. Jesus was in the boat taking a nap. Praise the name of God. And the winds became so contrary. Glory, hallelujah. And they came to Jesus. Oh, Jesus, oh, Jesus, we're about to perish. Jesus said to the disciples, oh, you have little faith. Jesus looked at the winds and said, peace, be still. Looked at the waves and said, don't you roll no more. And the winds, praise our God, started reciting. Praise our God, subsiding. And when the wind started subsiding, the demons who were behind the wind said to the wind, I told you to blow. And the wind spoke back to the demons. They said, ah, so you know who that is in that ship up there? Praise the name of our God. That's God up there in that ship. And he told me to stop. And when God says stop, you stop. Praise the name of God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. 